Today we're taking a bite out of science. Let's talk about that. Good mythical morning. You know, we've got years of experience eating things yeah. over our belts. Um, that was a pun. Was it over, to be a pun? right? Under our belts, but it was over because it's like where your belly is. You start over, and my, then it goes through and it goes under. Well, yeah. My point is, uh, we've been trained. If food is placed in front of us, we're gonna eat it. Oh, you know I am. But today, we're not gonna be eating food. We're gonna be making food do science. And if we do the science wrong, will we be okay? It's time for Food Science Without Guidance, featuring the Beaker Boys. That's right, the fabulous Beaker Boys That's are back. Us. All right, we're gonna be given items needed to conduct some kind of science experiment, this time specifically food science, with no instructions. Nope. Only instincts. Yep. There's gonna be some decoy. And arguments. Some decoy, oh no, we're gonna get along. There's gonna be some decoy items thrown in there to you know mix us up, throw us off, create some conflict. We're gonna start out with 44, points, Let, let's make it 45. Yeah, let's go 45. I don't know why I said 40. 45 points, and if we can put the right pieces together for the experiment and conduct it, uh, that's good, but we can also ask uh, for lifelines with the with points being taken away. Yeah, 45. Uh, if we have 20 points remaining at the end, we will win the greatest invention in food science history, the potato clock. Oh, that's my favorite kind of potatoes. Okay, Beaker Boys, you must use some combination of the items in front of you to a cheese and a, a cheese. Oh yeah, we don't want a cheese. Oh. No cheese here. An amazing scientific result. And you know at least one part of each experiment will involve a food or a drink. Your lifelines are as follows. A message from Science Mike Kayla about a scientific <laughs> principle <laughs> at play. Uh, it cost you one point. She's very enthusiastic. One point. We're I can, get that uh, every time. I can tell you the decoy item, because as right. you know, there's a decoy item. That's gonna cost you two points. Okay. How, many, how many decoy items are there in this round? There are two decoy items uh, in this oh, round. Oh, snap. And um, I can also tell you what result you're trying to achieve. That'll cost you three points. Ooh, that's expensive. And um, I don't want bless that. you. I'm allergic to lifelines. Bless you. <laughs> if right. you don't make science happen, when you talk of them, I sneeze. The time is up. That'll cost you five points. I'm gonna put ten minutes on the clock, and you're gonna get started right. Now. So this is the individually wrapped little piece of cotton candy. La piece. <laughs> this la, is a la piece of la piece. cotton candy. And then we've got uh, Jolly Ranchers. Yeah. We have four of this them. This is just a little pillow when you get tired. We have an aluminum straw. And then we have popcorn kernels. Oh yeah, that feels good. I don't know why, but it does. I'd like to take a bath in popcorn kernels. I'm sure Can we it bring be that arranged. segment back? Yep. And of course, we have a heat gun. Ooh. Ooh, it gets hot fast. And they gave me gloves. Yeah, the gloves are to be, to be used in tandem with the heat gun. So, all right. Well, I, mean, I really want to use the heat gun. So, it has to be the case that the heat gun is going to do something to the popcorn. We're going to make popcorn with heat. I mean, if that's not happening, then yeah, why you, am I here? Of course, these could be the two things. But here's what decoys. I think is going to happen. I think we're going to put one of these. In this? Oh yes, get and a, it get exploded. A, and then you're gonna pop it and it's gonna pop right into my mouth. We're gonna heat the side of the straw because it, it conducts heat. Oh, they're too small, they're it'll too heat big. Up. It'll heat up without melting. Get the littlest kernel you can find. Here's a little kernel. So you can stick it in this straw and then you can pop it in the Little mouth. kernel. That's what my aunt called me in preschool. <laughs> I gotta go pick out a little kernel. <laughs> <laughs> okay, little kernel, I'm gonna see if I can get this thing in there. We need a bigger straw. I'm gonna make this real hot. Is it real hot? Yes, immediately real hot. Oh, and I, I, I you need... wanna put a glove on? I, oh, yeah. See how hot yeah. that is? See, now, it's That's not- That's cowhide. It's not going in there. Yeah, no, I, you know, it's a pedestal for popping. You pop one at a time, and when it- <laughs> Is there, is there a little kernel in there? No, no. Well, why not? Because you threw it off. Here. I was making a little cotton candy bed for it. Ow! <laughs> Son of a, go! 
Is the heat gun on? I'm yeah, confused. Yeah, should... It's on and you're like waving it at the mic, at the right. everything. You know what, Link? Now it's just pointing in the air like a giant I'm 90% you know, sure. It, man. I'm 90% sure we don't need this. What's a little colonel doing in the backyard by himself? Did you see that one? He's making hot pops. But he's making his popcorn with his gun. He, he does that every day when I watch my stories. He he melts he melts Jolly Ranchers All right. onto him. This we, is so fun. Science you guys Mike have Kayla. five minutes. <laughs> we want to science Michaela. Yeah, yeah, we need a tip. We need a tip. All right, science Michaela. One point. What's up, nerds? Hey. <laughs> You're not good nerds, but here we go. Oh, Here's uh, your hint. Uh, when you have a non-crystalline transparent solid, it can easily take some heat. Got a it? A non-transparent crystalline solid. Non-crystalline transparent solid. Non-crystalline transparent solid. Well, that's a solid. Jolly Rancher. That's a Jolly Rancher. That's what they called them until they changed the name. You're getting there. You're it, getting no, there. Because the, the kids didn't want them. Then it can easily take some heat. It can easily. Yeah, so. Oh, oh. All she's saying is that we need to heat up a Jolly Rancher, which we've already done. No. I'm just so scared. No, no, no. Now. What you do? <laughs> the whole thing is hot. I think you got to get these coated in Jolly Ranchers, and then I don't know. Crap. I mean, this is a not. This is not a non-transparent. S Stevie, solid. we need to get rid of something. The straw. Yeah, you need to get rid of the popcorn kernels. <laughs> Good to know. Do we want the desired outcome or do we want to remove another thing? I think the Because I think we need the straw. We need the straw. You threw back. it freaking away. Yeah. Do we need the straw? No. Well, well you can't ask me that. What's the other thing we don't need? You also do not need the oh. cotton candy. Oh, we have another straw right there. They gave me another straw. Okay. We don't need the cotton candy. All right, so put the um, Jolly Rancher on the. Can take the heat. What is it taking the heat so we can slurp it up? You have less than three minutes, so if you want to ask me what you're supposed to be doing. I think we got to cheat. All right. I think we got to get it. Cheat? No, I think we got to get it. Tell us what point. the desired outcome is. Careful. You wouldn't want this hot experiment to blow up. See? Oh, well, you're blowing bubbles. You With Jolly Rancher. With Jolly Ranchers. So here, you give me that. All right, so we need, we want to um, we want to melt the Jolly Rancher. We want to put it on, on the, the train. thing. On, on the tray. Oh, we're gonna make Jolly Rancher bubbles. You better hurry, because this is gonna be cool. You better hurry. I gotta turn it up. You gotta go fast. Okay, there we go. Yeah, like that. Whoa! Ah! <laughs> what was that? You gotta get even more. You did it, man. You created like... Holy what? It's a snake! It's a Jolly Rancher snake! What? Look at what you've done. Stevie, With less we're than done a minute. It. Less we're than a minute it. left, and, and, now we and can you've eat done it. it. Oh, that's a good point. Yeah, I guess so. Here, I'll blow it in your mouth. How are you getting it? How are you getting so much in there? Uh. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Uh, perhaps the oh. heat gun should be turned off at this point yeah, because it's pointed off. at the desk. We did it! We did it! We did it! Look at uh, that. Rock candy, like Jolly Ranchers, is a non-crystalline transparent solid that uses corn syrup to prevent the sugar from crystallizing, oh. thus making it a sugar glass. Because glass is an amorphous solid, it has a molecular structure that's random like a liquid, making it transparent and shapeable when heated. It's like glass. So we can make bulbs out of Jolly Ranchers? Jolly Rancher light bulbs? Yeah. Yeah. And it tastes great. All right, boys. Same lifelines as before. I'm putting 10 minutes on the clock. Time begins now. Last right. time we used all our lifelines. We got to be better than that. Gatorade. The bigger boys can't be using every lifeline. Hot water, a lemon, a water bottle, a bowl. They said the bowl was an item, and a knife. I think my theory is we're the gonna make cuts the lemon. lemon flavored cool blue Gatorade and we're gonna sell it 
in these little things. This is a business. This is a business science experiment. What to like golfers? We're gonna be like on a golf course. I don't course. know. I think that's what we have to figure out. No, we're gonna do this, and it's gonna be hello sharks. Good Open it up for that right there. Mark Cuban is gonna love this. All right. So what we're gonna do is you want to go. You want to go nipple down or always go nipple down. I don't know what you would call that part. And then what you're saying you is you can catch the milk. You just want to like <laughs> hold on. Yeah, and it's gonna create a vacuum and it's gonna make the lemon goat flavor go into the Gatorade. Yeah, look at this. Oh, look what you've done. No, no, check it out. What about done? Look around the Gatorade. Yeah. The the water around the Gatorade is now blue. But it's an optical illusion. You see that, Stevie? Is that what you're looking for? Oh gosh! I told look, man, you gotta watch what you what you touch because everything's like, hot today. What? Now you see how blue that water is? Now watch this. Not blue! Not blue! Hey! <laughs> Not blue! We got that one in like a minute! Is that Truthfully, it? Truthfully, I'm surprised that everything around you isn't blue today, Rhett. <laughs> I knew we'd be working with colors today. <laughs> and I wanted to be very bright and noticeable. So I didn't want to get lost behind all the colors, Stevie. Thanks for making me feel self-conscious. I think we're gonna. We got to get rid of something. Cut the. Let's the get lemon. a lemon. Let's get a decoy before we start cutting things. Give us a decoy. You do not need the lemon. Uh, oh, the lemon's hot. <laughs> <laughs> all right. See, I think a knife with a hole. If in if it. you pour hot water over this, it's gonna. It's Contract. gonna it's gonna heat the air inside, and because it's a closed system, it's gonna contract. Yeah. Let's just test this part. Oh gosh, that Gatorade is hot. Oh, it's gonna explode. It's going the wrong direction. <laughs> it's pointing at you. It's not. It wasn't getting smaller. It's getting bigger. Oh, it's gonna blow. Hit it with a knife. <laughs> <laughs> Going in hot. Is this what we're supposed to be doing? I mean, we think that we give you safe things and this is yeah. what you do? Poke it. <laughs> it's unpokeable. We, we've made unbreakable glass. I mean, we've made unbreakable plastic. It's plastic. Dude. We've made plastic that cannot be broken. <laughs> look at Look at how plump that thing is. Here, that thing is ready hey. to Pop. We go into, look at how pretty that is. We go into Shark Tank. That's like a butt in Beverly Hills. <laughs> Hello, sharks. You have less than five minutes. Put it, put Michaela, come out here. It's a weeble wobble bottle. So that's good, that's good, that's good, that's no, good. No, 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 no. You don't, don't have to go all the way to the top. He got here. Oh. How cool Did is you, that? It, it, is it that looks, it? No, Give us nowhere a hint. near. Okay, a decrease in surface pressure may just be the pull you need. The pull. So you're right. We're gonna pull something in. Look at this. <laughs> a decrease in surface pressure may be the pull you need. We've made bottles that can't be stood up. Oh, oh, a oh. decrease in surface pressure. Get a new Gatorade. Get a new bottle. Well, mission accomplished. Take the bottle and then hold on. A new bowl. Undo this. Ugh. Sorry, I made that noise. Put this in there. Do this. We're gonna make Gatorade go. This is how we're gonna get the Gatorade into our bottles at the factory. No, this is gonna get bigger. We know that. We've already done a that. A decrease in a surface. A decrease in surface. You put you put the boiling water around on the, the bottom. Gatorade on the bottom, and it sends it into the thing. Do we need to get? Do we need another thing? Do we need another decoy? I think it's the knife. The knife. We don't need the knife. Yeah, we don't need that knife. I feel a suck. Is it, is it a suck? Oh, did you see that? No. We need another hint. We'll take any kind. <laughs> uh, okay, I hope this helps you. I think it's time you guys sucked it up about the difference in temperatures. That, this, that's no different than what Michaela told us. That was worthless. <laughs> no, suck it up. she so said pull and I said suck. See, I knew she wanted to say suck. <laughs> but only you were willing to say so. You have less than two minutes. Gatorade is cold. Hot water it's is hot. hot. Yes, I knew that too. <laughs> okay, new bowl, new bowl, new bowl, new bowl. Ow, that's hot. So pour oh, the. Oh gosh, that's hot. Pour the Gatorade into the bowl. No. 
Mm-hmm. Difference in temperatures. No, you're right. Oh, oh no, no. Why are you doing that? Yeah, because it's making it cold. Making what cold? The bowl? A bottle. What? Get another one of these. We don't have another one. We're gonna do like this. Oh, oh, yes! Get. And we're gonna we're gonna take this top off and we're gonna put that right there. Yeah. You're gonna hold that. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna pour, pour scalding hot water <laughs> all over your hand. I just think this is really cool. I mean, look at that. It's the smoothest. It's yeah, the smoothest it has no 30. creases in it. it. Has no creases in it. Is you know this what? An official give up? No, we just ran out of time. Pour the hot water. <laughs> Pour the hot water on that. See what happens. <laughs> oh! I got it. Man, science has never felt so much like a failure. All right, let's uh, see what you were actually supposed to do, shall we? Oh, Caitlin! See, I was she right poured, about that. She, see, she threw stuff too. Oh, a little bit of hot water. Two bowls? We only have one bowl. What the, what the? Why is she so happy? <laughs> She's so happy because when a gas heats up, its pressure increases because the molecules take up more space. So when you empty a bottle of hot water, the air inside is warmer than the air around the bottle. And as that air begins to cool down, placing it on a liquid surface causes the surface pressure to decrease. And because the air inside the bottle begins to shrink as it cools, it pulls the Gatorade into the bottle. Yeah, but look at what we made. Yeah. <laughs> Announcing, this is no decoy item. We got a U2's collectible. The yeah, official Rhett and Link U2's theme is from the prom to the red carpet. Check this thing out. Of you course, know us, we have our famous prom pose that we yeah. did back in the day and we love to recreate that when we get dressed up and go out on the town. Yeah, check, check this out. We've got the official U2's version of us doing our prom photo pose which we do on every red carpet. This is the last quarterly collectible item of 2022 for the society. You know, you gotta be a third degree monthly member by October 31st if you wanna get this, mythicalsociety.com. Look at these guys, extremely detailed, extremely well made. We had to pose for hours for them to get all the details right. Perfect for your bookshelf or wherever you want to set this. I had to make that face. Put it up, put it on like, as a hood ornament on your car. Check that thing out. No, don't do that. That's against your state laws, probably. Unless it's against your state laws. I'm gonna let it nestle in right there before it goes back to a spot up there on the filing cabinet later. Uh, all right, Stevie. Mythicalsociety.com. What we got going on over here? Okay, so this is your final round, and, and you're doing pretty well. I, I wanted nah. to, uh, you know, I think it needs to be a little bit more difficult. Make things, uh, you know, more entertaining. So this round, you have three decoys instead of what two. And also, you only have eight minutes to complete the experiment. All right, we got a hard-boiled egg. Let's do it. We've got Altadena, not a sponsor, milk. We've got Coca-Cola, not a sponsor. And then we're burning the end of a dowel rod. I'm just sterilizing it. Is it, it. just a dowel? What is that? Because I believe rod? this is gonna be inserted into your, some orifice. And I have to get it. Some orifice. <laughs> You smorphous. That's when you use wood to put <laughs> burning. You put wood. you put wood in somebody's orifice and put them over a fire. It's a smorphous. <laughs> <laughs> Gross. 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 <laughs> Gross. Something special. Michaela, we like to hear from you. So come on out here, but don't say anything. We have twenty six points left. We can't go below twenty. So six points total. And how much do you cost? I'm only one. All right, point. let's hear it. All right. So y'all are besties, right? Yeah. Yeah. Uh-huh. So it could be tough and rough to break bonds, but it's necessary for this experiment. Breaking bonds can be tough and rough, but it's necessary. Does this have anything? Not to really do? tough. I added that for a little flavor. Oh, you did? Yeah. Does this have but it's just to rough. Do Let's see. With, <laughs> does this have anything to do with disgraced former baseball player Barry Bonds? No. <laughs> Um, I think we're gonna make a lava lamp out of Coke and an egg and milk. How about this? You can choose the item you want to ask me about. I, I what item do you want to get rid of? I mean, we got to keep the heat, right? We should ask about the heat. 
Is this a keeper? You do not need the lighter. Okay, good. See that tells Ooh. that tells <laughs> that tells us so many things. And then you let go. Oh, you make egg coke. It's it is is sucking. It is sucking. See? Oh, oh, that was percussive. We're gonna make egg coke, y'all. They don't have egg coke in the freestyle machine. I'll tell you that much. It's kind of my thing. Stop. And Stop. Now oh, and now we shake. Now you shake, yeah. Why would it? Sh <laughs> ah! <laughs> I wonder what that tastes like. What? Oh, you think that's gonna? Oh, oh, yep. <laughs> you think that coke that you just shook up is gonna go everywhere? I just wanted to taste it. Michaela, come back out here. Okay. <laughs> but you, we can't call Michaela back out. I, I just need moral support. Oh. Um. <laughs> we can still find out from Stevie what we need to be doing and just have two, 20 points. Stevie. No, we gotta remove another thing. No, we gotta know what we're doing. Two minutes. <laughs> you think it'd be more helpful to get rid of another item? Stevie? I do. Okay, what other item do we not need? You have to ask me about one. Do we need the Coke? Yes. Yes, ask me about another one. Do we need the egg? You do not need the egg. Okay, Crap. do we have to eat it? So so the Coke is necessary? Yeah. So we it's- We can't either... ask about another thing though, because we'll- Well, I kind of want to, I mean, I, I'm rooting for you guys, and so, uh, if it's Great okay, bonds. I'm gonna give you the other decoy for free. Okay. Is that, you like that? Yes. You do not need the milk. Okay. We're gonna start a Coke fire. We did. All it is is it can be rough to break bonds. Rough, how do we roughen this? Just like roughen it. <laughs> Worth it. <laughs> Man, you are, I'm just trying things. Sad, dude. <laughs> Rug, what is the bond? I don't know. What's the seconds? bond? <laughs> I don't want to see Caitlin's <laughs> devilish grin again. And time. Ah. Uh, All right. Uh, let's check out how this is actually done. She's taking the cap off. She's putting. What is she doing? That's not a straw. What the, what the crap does she just do? <laughs> what, what, what are you telling me here? No, she tapped it first, she tapped it, she tapped it, and then she put it in. You do that. That got nothing to do with it, man. It's just the wood reacts to it. Oh! All we had to do was put it in there! Oh my God! You're telling me I can take a piece of wood to a party and just stick it in people's Cokes? Is it so crazy. Wait, while they're drinking. Pinocchio could have a blast. Is what a Coke? <laughs> okay, so when you open a soda bottle, the pressure is released and the CO2 in the drink wants to escape. That's why you get bubbles. But when you add a rough surface, like a wooden stick, it allows the bonds between the gas and the drink to break more easily, helping create more ca carbon dioxide bubbles at a faster rate. It's the same principle as Mentos and Coke. So it's just that it's rough? Sure. <laughs> it's, I mean, this feels like some kind of drink you could do at a bar where you just put a wooden straw in there, you know, and then give everybody a tray. Oh man, I'm exhausted and my spirit is broken. No, it's still intact. Thanks for subscribing and clicking that. The bell. Beaker Boys will be back. You know what time it is. Hi, I'm Via from Brazil. And it's time to spin the wheel of mythicality. Yeah, sometimes a jar of peanut butter can scare you a little bit. <laughs> Click the top link to watch us guess the animal food pun in Good Mythical More. And to find out where the wheel of mythicality is gonna land. To get the red link, you two's collectible join Third Degree Monthly by October 31st. Visit mythicalsociety.com for details.